My name is Ben White. Uh, amongst other things, I'm a researcher at Bournemouth University, and we have been undertaking a study into flexible copyright exceptions or and open norms for Knowledge Rights 21. As part of the study, we've looked at the United States and six other countries, including Canada, Israel, Sri Lanka, Singapore, South Korea, and Japan, um, to understand why they introduced more flexible copyright uh, exceptions into their law. And by that, I mean um, e exceptions which are, are, are open and are not um, the sort of prescriptive exceptions that we see in Europe. And certainly looking at uh, Israel and the other countries in Asia, we can see that one of the prime motive was to support business research, science, and te the technology sectors. Um, from, from a copyright law perspective, the introduction of open norms has really, um, in, 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 in Japan and Israel, certainly created an opportunity for uh, the judiciary as well as lawmakers to, to think again about the purpose of copyright law. So has had, I think, a sort of a, a refreshing quality to, to copyright law. Um, certainly looking at Israel, another interesting thing that we've discovered is that despite opposition from US lobbyists from the entertainment industry, uh, there, there is an interesting Israeli study which shows that none of the uh, calamities that were forecast have come, come to fruition. Uh, the, the, the courts in Israel, despite transplanting fair use from abroad was able to bring their own legal traditions and and also use US case law so none of the problems that were forecast came came to bear